YouTube, this your boy, J Diggy 92 coming at y'all with another review. Look, man, today we got, as y'all seen, a pair of human race shows. If you don't know, now you know. Um, look, man, this is like, what, my fourth pair of human races? Um, so yeah, man. Let's get straight into it. No need for prolonged intros and all that good shit. Um, let's just pop the lid. Pull these bad boys up, why not? Mm -hmm. You like the sound of that? Mm -hmm. I bet you do. But um, these are the Solar Pack in red. Um, I say red. I got these in a size 12. Um, the official colorway. Is nowhere to be seen on these bitches, so hopefully I can find it in the on the in internets and stuff. Um, but yeah, these is part of the solar pack, it's the solar hue pack or whatever you want to call it. Um, but yeah, I'm not really seeing much about like official colorway or whatever. But um. These are the for real human races. If you don't know human races, you kind of been under a rock. And I know it's human race, it's just, I'm speaking, it's plural. So, um, that's why I keep saying races. But um, yeah, man, human races, human race. These are different from pretty much all the other human race packs I've seen. Um, excuse me, I have, the multicolored ones, the uh, sun glow ones, and the black holly jumps. None of those have this pretty much blocked off feature with just a plain word. Well, not a word, just words in it. They, they'll they have like writing and everything else, but it's never been like blocked off like this. So this is like just a little different. Um, the more I'm looking at the shoe, the more I'm like, damn, this shoe is like kind of crazy looking. It looks like a like Cosby sweater, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> but um, these were probably my favorite out of the out of the three. Um, I think there was what was the other colorways? Um, I know this was one. Then it was like a pink one, if I'm not mistaken. Um. It was like a pink one. Where is it? Oh, yeah, like a pink one. And then this like turquoise, orange, and gray one. So out of all three of those, these were like the hardest to me. Um, because I felt like these would be like the easiest to match with stuff. I don't know what it is about human races, but like the colorway would be fire, but the cage just throws it completely off. So thankfully, the cage on here, they made it black. So let's go ahead and get straight into like some of the details of this shoe. So the upper, you got an all knit upper. Yes, it's all knit. Um, I'm pretty sure this shit is gonna be hard as hell to clean if you get like a stain on it. So like I try to stay away from wearing these. Like if it's like messy outside or some other shit, yes, you can clean with Angelus, I prefer Angelus, and like Jason Marks and Rejuvenator and all them, but like why even risk it? Like, you paying this much for some shoes, like why even risk it? Um, so yeah, pretty much all knit upper. The yellow parts of the shoe are like stand out, it's like embossed, so it's like they don't blend directly in with the gray as y'all can see. They don't blend in, they stand out, so it's like ridges almost. I wish they did do that, cause like it really has that sweater feel. Like this shit looks like a damn beehive, like with them doing that shit. But I bought them, so I can't really talk shit. Well, I can talk shit cause I bought them, but I'm not talking shit, I'm just saying what it looks like. Um, but yeah, and then you got the block that says empower on one and then inspire on the other. Um, I think it's a dope concept. I just wish they wouldn't have blocked this off, but I'm pretty sure 
they did block it off because if not, you wouldn't be able to either A, see the word empower or inspire on it because of like the colorway or it would have like, it would have been wavy since like the yellow parts are like embossed and like they're like stand out against the um, actual like material of the shoe. So I'm pretty sure that's why they did that, but I wish they didn't because like it's just a big block in the middle of the shoe. Um, but yeah, like I said, black cage, then like the interior, you got that real like Cosby sweater tribal vibe going on. And then y'all know the insoles is like, what the fuck was that? I heard something as well. I look like that. But um, yeah, like your inside it says like pretty much when you stepping and when you walk in like what, oh, it was a shoe. What part of like the body is being affected while you're walking. So um, yeah, I, I always like that about human races. Then on the bottom, you got the red like trail pattern um, also. And then you got that big ass hunk of boost just sitting right there as your midsole. Um, do I like these? Yes. Do I feel like I should pay more than retail for these? Honestly, if you didn't want to pay more for retail for these, you didn't have to because these restock like three or four times. These alone, the solar pack restock, the holly pack restock, and I feel like it was one more that restock. Yeah, the um, what's them shits called? The other pack. What was the other pack called? Um, shit. I'm gonna find it. Yeah, the Human Race Inspiration Pack. Those, like, restock too. So it was like, everything pretty much restocked at like some crazy time. I remember I was at work when I got these and it was like, it wasn't bad early, but it was early. It was like, I say like 8.30, 8.40 in the morning. And like, these had restocked. And y'all know retail on these is 250. So like, it was like a steep purchase, but I was like, fuck it. I'm like, this probably might be the only time I will be able to find these for like retail um, to where I'm not paying resale. So I went ahead and got them. But needless to say, if you wanted them, um, you could have definitely picked them up because they, I don't know what it is about human races, man. Um, but apparently, people ain't either people are sick of them or they feel like the market is getting oversaturated because I've been like seeing a few been sitting like these don't set like for a minute, dog. Like, I don't know, man. Like, they they really set on like the Adidas website, they were sitting. Um, they just been sitting on stock X. What are these going for? I pay retail if y'all haven't figured that out already. I only pay retail plus shipping. So probably like 260, 265, somewhere around that range. The official price should have popped up on screen. But um, yeah, like these have been sitting. So we gonna check stock X for the official price or what the resale is. Damn, resale kind of jumped back up. So right now for a size 12 like these are, you gotta pay 303, which ain't horrible. It's just an extra like 50 some dollars. But then when you factor in shipping, it's probably like 60, 70 bucks almost. Um, 11 and a half, 332, 11, 315, 10 and a half, 300. They're pretty much that 300 price range. Size seven and a half is retail. If you wear, if you got smaller feet, you're kind of good, but then sometimes you're not. Like, it's hard to judge these. Um, and so that's Stock X. Y'all know Stock X is usually lower than GOAT in some situations, unless you're looking for used. I wouldn't suggest getting these used because you want them to mold to your feet, not somebody else's. Um, on GOAT, 
the only thing with GOAT, sometimes they'll have like damage box and all everything else. The damage box ones is 285 for a size 12, a size 12 is 370, 12 and a half, 330, 11 and a half, 335, 11, 370, blah, 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 blah. Like I said, under retail that's not under retail 260 is not under retail it's still open um but yeah man like i said you can get these if you really want them um and you could have been had them if you really wanted them because they restocked like two or three times along with the inspiration pack the holly pack only restocked once and i think they sold out as soon as they restocked um i didn't need them Luckily, because I got the, my favorite out of the Holly Pack and like the Inspiration Pack, the ones I want is the green ones and those didn't restock. So, out of everything, these were like the only ones I wanted to cop until they bring out more colorways. So, these are the um, Solar Solar Human Race NMDs. Um, go true to your Adidas size. Uh, size 12 i know i didn't say that but definitely want to go true to your adidas size um don't go down half a size because this cage will fuck you up if you go down go down half a size that this cage on the side that shit will fuck your whole foot up like feels weird when you first like get in it and everything else but once it shapes to your foot you're fine but if you go down a half a size you're fucked um yeah and that's why i said you don't want to buy these shoes because you don't want someone's foot already molded to the shape of the shoe. Then you get the shoe in the areas maybe your foot is narrow in, their foot was wide in. And then, the, or vice versa, your foot is wide in, their shit was narrow in. So now you got to re break a shoe in. It's probably worse than what it would have been if you just got it for retail or whatever. And plus, people be dogging the fuck out of shoes. So, I try not to get anything used unless it's like near dead stock and I can like bring it back to life or some shit, but I wouldn't get bitch shoes used, period. Fuck that. It's a lot of shit you can hide on a knit shoe that when you get it, you be like, this shit is all frayed and everything. Yeah, so don't even, don't play yourself. But um, yeah, man, I think that's all I want to hip y'all to. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this video and if you did, Go ahead and smack that thumbs up and that like button for me. Subscribe so you can join the motherfucking God Squad. You already know we the best squad on YouTube. And if you don't know, now you know. You said it, not me. Um, yeah, man. Uh, you want to follow me on anything? You can follow me on Instagram, Twitter, Snap, and Snapchat. All of that at jdiggy92. I love y'all, man. Thank y'all so much for watching. Um, shout out to that art page. Fitness Guy Masterpieces. Go copy out some dope art. And shout out to the gaming channel, Savage God Gaming. Um, we be playing games and shit. Um, so yeah, man. I think that's all I wanted to say. Any questions or comments, leave it down in the comment section below. And I'll definitely get back with you. Um, and enjoy this on feet that comes like at the same time in this video. So this has been your boy, JDiggy92. Another episode of Finesse Kicks. The Solar Human Race Pack in the red colorway. And... Uh, like I always say, I love y'all, and I will see y'all when I see y'all.